Are you aware of the fact that certain bugs can be extremely dangerous and may even cause cardiac arrest? It's important to avoid contact with such insidious insects, as well as those that can transmit serious diseases and those that can damage trees and shrubs in a short period of time. In this video, I'll be highlighting some of the world's most dangerous bugs that you should steer clear of at all times. Let's dive in. Reduvida. Reduvida can be called the hitman from the beetle world, and among insects in general, it's a ruthless arthropod that feeds on insects and their larvae. As a rule, these true bugs are fond of ants. They attack ants, suck them dry, and then carry the carcasses of ants on their backs. It looks pretty creepy. The bug dragging 10 to 20 ants glued to each other is a terrific spectacle. Reduvida drags ants so they can always have a strategic reserve. When a bug gets hungry, it feeds on an ant and then throws off the ant's empty chitinous carapace on the ground. But Reduvide poses a danger not only to ants. Humans should stay away from this cruel killer too. A number of insects in the Reduvide family drink blood and therefore bite humans. Reduvide are responsible for carrying Chagas disease. After contact with a bug, a person may develop a fever, headache, enlarged lymph nodes, and other symptoms. After a few weeks, the disease progresses to a chronic stage. The disease can be treated well in its early stages but can be fatal if left untreated. Some people living in poor rural areas become victims of these bugs, so they are definitely not to be messed with. Spanish fly. The reason for the name Spanish fly is unclear as it has very little in common with flies. In fact, it's a type of blister beetle. These insects are found in southern and central parts of European Russia, Ukraine, and Kazakhstan where they live and feed on plants. While the Spanish fly is a beautiful insect, it can cause significant damage to gardens as it feeds on many plants such as olive, honeysuckle, raspberry, and lilac. A single colony can destroy a large lilac bush in just 24 hours. Although they are also poisonous, some people catch and collect them as they have become popular as an aphrodisiac. However, it's important not to underestimate the danger they pose as they release a substance that can irritate the skin and cause a strong allergic reaction. The effects of contact with the Spanish fly can be similar to those of an attack by the Meloproscorabius, another type of blister beetle. Meloproscorabius. Meloproscorabius is an unusual name for a no less unusual beetle of the blister beetle family. The body of this beetle is clumsy and fleshy, and females have a considerably swollen abdomen that's only partially covered with elytra. These clumsy creatures do not exceed 4 centimeters in length, but you shouldn't laugh at these ugly bugs because these beetles are poisonous. If you take the beetle in your hands, it will protect itself by spraying an oily, unpleasant-smelling liquid. Once on human skin, it causes irritation, blisters like from a burn, boils, and in some cases can even lead to respiratory and cardiac distress. So it's better to keep away from the bug and admire it from a distance. If you see these bugs, you have only a few seconds to run away. The bugs won't catch up with you, and you'll be safe. Firebug During the summertime of the year, the firebug can be found in gardens. It's difficult to confuse it with other bugs because it has a rather bright and interesting coloration. Its pronotum has a black spot, wings are dark gray, and the abdomen is red. The red and black colors remind one of a fire truck, hence the bug's name. These bugs aren't large, growing only up to one and a half centimeters. In addition, they have no chitin, so the bug shouldn't be particularly dangerous, right? Unfortunately, that's not the case. It's the exact opposite. The tissues of this insect contain cantharidin, a poisonous substance that protects the bug from natural enemies, and the fire coloring serves as a warning to birds, frogs, and other animals that may try to eat the bug. While animals are aware of the danger of this bug, humans may not be. In the garden, you may want to hold this beautiful bug in your hands to get a better look. You should never do that. Firebugs are predators with strong jaws, so they can bite humans, and the bite can be quite painful. Despite this, firebugs are useful. If the vegetable garden is full of insect pests that are part of the firebugs' diet, it can help reduce their population and protect the crop. 
Unfortunately, not all bugs are as useful as firebugs. Some of them should definitely not be allowed into your garden or even the forest because they can destroy it completely. Stay tuned to see the world's most dangerous injurious insects that harm agriculture, causing multi-million dollar damage. Let's move on. Asian Longhorn Beetle The Asian Longhorn Beetle is a very small beetle, measuring no more than three and a half centimeters long and barely over a centimeter wide. Nevertheless, the Asian Longhorn Beetle is considered one of the most dangerous beetles in the world because it can cause incredible damage to crops and forest plantations. This beetle feeds on a wide variety of hardwoods and is capable of damaging over 50 different species of plants, including maple, chestnut, poplar, birch, willow, ash, acacia, and many others, including fruit trees. The Asian longhorned beetle prefers apple trees and mulberries. Both healthy and weakened plants are eaten by the bug. Trees can be destroyed not only by adults, but also by small larvae of the Asian longhorn beetle. The natural habitat of these injurious insects is China, the Korean Peninsula, Vietnam, and Taiwan. In these regions, the Asian longhorn beetle causes much inconvenience, but it has also stirred up trouble at the other end of the world in the United States, where it arrived by chance along with packaging material. In the USA, these beetles have posed an extremely serious threat to hardwood trees and caused multi-million dollar damage to the country. Emerald Ash Borer The situation is similar with the Emerald Ash Borer. These beetles are also small, up to a centimeter in length and several millimeters in width, and they are native to Asia as well. They inhabit China, Korea, and Japan, as well as the Russian Far East and they were introduced to North America too. After which, locals and government officials realized the power of these bugs. The emerald ash borer is a very dangerous agricultural pest. The victims of these bugs tend to be ash trees, which is clear from the name of the species. These bugs are so ruthless in their destruction of trees that later, the plants actually cease to be aligned. It's recommended to cut down a tree infested with emerald ash borers immediately and then burn the trunk with the roots right on the spot. Colorado Beetle Next, we have probably the most famous beetle in the world, the Colorado Beetle. I'm sure you've all heard of the Colorado Beetle at least once. Why do you think it's so popular? Maybe the Colorado Beetle is a great exotic pet, or it's so useful for the farm that it's become the talk of the world. In fact, it's the opposite. The beetles and larvae of the species feed on the leaves of plants of the nightshade family, making them dangerous agricultural pests. The beetle got its name after it devastated potato fields in the U.S. state of Colorado in the mid-19th century. The Colorado beetle loves to devour potatoes, sweet peppers, tomatoes, and eggplants. A whole army of these beetles can destroy a full crop, so the fight against these dangerous insects is very tough. Pest control measures include a number of complex measures, from the use of pesticides and special planting of plants, mixed with crops unpleasant for the Colorado beetles, to the introduction of predatory bugs in their habitat. Although the measures partly help, Colorado beetles still cause great inconvenience to farmers and gardeners. Common Pine Shoot Beetle Common pine shoot beetles belong to the subfamily of bark beetles. Bark and splint wood are their main specialties. These four centimeter long monsters attack pines and destroy these trees in no time. Sometimes, however, they switch from pines to spruces, but this happens very rarely. Common pine shoot beetles attack important tree tissues, the wood and the splint wood through which water and nutrients are transported. The beetles attack the young leading shoots of pine trees and eat their cores, so later these shoots are often broken by the wind, which makes the pines look as though they've been shorn. Simply put, common pine shoot beetles weaken a tree's defenses when the beetles attack frequently. The pines wither and become impossible to save. Moreover, these insects are not only capable of gnawing out the tree, but also carry fungal infections. To destroy these dangerous agricultural pests, trap trees are laid or bait trees are arranged by cutting off the tops of some pine trees. That's all, guys. 
Which of these bugs surprised you the most? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching and see you later.